You are now tuned in to Heat Check with Ty Slider and Antonio Turner right here on GTA Sports Network. Follow GTA Sports Network on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, as well as GTA Heat Check, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. Subscribe to the YouTube channel, GTA Sports, and check out GTASportsNet.com for all things in the world of sports. Hey, hello everyone, this is Tasha Slam. Antonio Turner. Welcome to another edition of GTA Heat Check. Brought to you by GTA Sports Network. If you don't already make sure you GTA Sports Network, GTA Heat Check on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. Subscribe to the YouTube channel, GTA Sports, and don't forget GTASportsNet.com for all things in the world of sports. And this is the free agency edition of GTA Heat Check. I don't have any other I didn't even want to ask that. Hey, you, you knew what the answer was. It's all good over here. Let me and start Laker off by saying Laker Nation won. Draft absolutely, Lakers Nation just won free agency absolutely by last time. Now, that's not to say that the that's not to say the other teams in the league didn't get better. I mean, the Heat they got better, but you don't, you do you got the Heat coming out of the East? I didn't say all that. No, okay, they didn't say all that. They didn't get better. They didn't get that much better. Back where they were, no? Okay, well, what is that? Where were they in top three? Okay. But not number two and not number one, right? Maybe number two. Maybe. I like that. Maybe. I like that. <laughs> because that takes the nets. So don't send down number three. No, I got Brooklyn number one. Ah, uh, <laughs> let me raise that yet. <laughs> this year is a show and prove year for Brooklyn. <laughs> now, before I even get into the Brooklyn, I'm about to say, you know, yeah. I, I, they are part of the conversation, but a little bit. Towards the end, yeah, they ain't, gonna, they ain't really make no moves. They got a little, a little. They ain't make too many moves. They got rid of no people. new people. Well, they got one new person. They got bad news. Yeah, one new person. They got a better. They brought back the other people. Though. Well, they let go of Denny. Though they, well, they, they, we knew they wouldn't match that. Yeah, true. We knew that. Oh, so sorry. Nah, nah. But as far as the big major moves, the Los Angeles Lakers acquired. Oh man, you know what? Before I even say it, let me just get the list together. Nice little grocery list. Let me just get the list together of all the players they acquired here. You said the first one on draft night. Live yeah, reaction. yeah, yeah, that was live. The last episode, yeah, y'all know about Rush. Y'all know Russell Westbrook. Yeah. That was, that's how they won draft night. Man, they definitely stole draft night with that. Let's see what we got here. So, as you know, Lakers starting big three, you know, LeBron James, Anthony Davis, Russell Westbrook. Now you got to add Carmelo Anthony to your list. Got a one year deal. Marcus saw lead up for another deal. I think it was a one year or was already on the same time. He was already on the year. He signed a two year deal last year. Last year. Yeah. Trevor Reed signed a one year deal. Come Dwight back. Howard came back again. So these are returning former yeah. Lakers. Mm-hmm. Dwight Howard did another one year deal. Ken Rose Bazemore Rose. came back didn't know when you did. Wayne Ellington came back and did a one year deal. Um, yeah. Let's see who else we got here. Now, of course, we're gonna do that. They had to get rid of Kyle Kuzma, KCP. Thank God to yo. Of course, do you thank God for Kuzma? Thank God. Thank God, Kuzma. See what he wasn't gonna do. He, his career wasn't gonna go no farther as where he's at right now. If he didn't leave, yeah, not and he got me think about it. He hadn't had a chance to elevate since Andy Davis got him. Right. So or LeBron, whichever one. AD's here for a long time. So basically it, it basically overlapped Kyle Kuzma's development. Right. Unlike Brandon Ingram, Lonzo Ball, who y'all might have laughed at when they got traded, but then they got better because they got traded. Because their timelines didn't match up with LeBron's timeline. Right. They needed to go somewhere else to develop. Speaking of Alonzo Ball, Uh-oh. Chicago Bulls. I'm making a hot take. I told you. Are they going to the playoffs? Now, are they going to be top three in the East? Hell. Top five? Possibly. Six? I said possibly. Okay. They I should. didn't say not like They should be possibly. in the East. With the, with, if they okay, not top with, five, with their current with their current roster, we'll just go if they ahead. not top five, with their current roster, not top six. if their roster that they have on paper cannot get them a playoff, not a, follow me, no, read my, the, no, seven, not eight. a play in, playoff, 
right. Billy Donovan's job is on the line. Like a clock's ticking because Chicago Bulls spent some money. Lonzo got a four year, $85 million deal from the Bulls. Uh, marketing got shipped out to Charlotte. And he got a bag from Charlotte through the deal. Um, they got DeMar DeRozan. He got bad. He got three years, eighty-five million. Right. Um, what was he picked up? Was it just Well, because remember they traded for Luke Bitch. Yeah, that was a mid-season. Yeah, exactly. Luke Bitch and uh, what else did they get? They got a uh, what? Another person on the Oh, Russo. Hey. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Russo got like thirty-four million. Oh, yeah. three years, sure. thirty-four or something like that. Oh, that's fine, but. It's still a bag, regardless. It's still, it's still a bag. It's a little mini bag. He would have been starting when you pick up the rose. Yeah, he got it. Yeah, he got it. Yeah, you you got to go in with Lonzo when you break. Yeah, exactly. Coming for Lonzo. Um, yeah, hot take Chicago to the playoffs. Uh, shout out to DJ Ash. Shout out to him. Uh, uh, Chicago, y'all got the first round, too. Y'all, technically, with the level of talent y'all have, y'all got all stars. Because Lonzo, you know, he hasn't made an all star team. He yeah, has he all star numbers. Yeah, true. And he just didn't make it on team with Zion and B.I. Exactly. It's going to be tough to make it in Chicago, too. You know, honestly, he don't have to. Yeah, well, I mean, with Levine and Vukovic, they well, both all stars. They both already. can. They both already. If he's not starting, he can get sick man of the year and most improved. Well, I'm not. Definitely. Can you improve from what he did last year? Yes. So, numbers one? Like yeah. score? Yeah. You got a good point. I'm not going to. Um, I'm not. No, you you said that. I'm like, not arguing that. Everybody took a loss. I'm not. Arguing and everybody. I think I was always the loss. loss. Only person I know that was gonna say big. So he's got. He's clear. Huh? He not. He, he not. He's he, not. He, 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 he said he's the ESPN analyst. Yeah, exactly. I didn't know that's what he did. Yeah. He's not coaching. No hey, he's not young. He's probably a coach on top of that. No, nah, he's better. He's a better coach. I tell you a job he should get though that would actually probably help him. He should go be an assistant coach for the Lakers. Because, because well, I'm going to tell you where he's because going. It, because it works. Yeah, but where he's going, he's back to ESPN as an analyst. What? <laughs> or NBA TV. You ain't giving him no coaching job? Or NBA TV. No more coaching job? Nah. Oh, uh, he done? Look, he over when you just brought up his brothers, Dan Gunny. Oh, it's over. So he didn't get to the final In the one job. finals that you got to get there. But the one finals, the number of veteran shooters around the white. Working. And I don't know if it'll well, work. I mean, that won't work no more. That's why I said the Lakers yeah. make sense. I'm not saying as a head really. coach. I'm saying as a defensive coach for veteran defense. I mean, he's going to be the bottom coach. Of the he'll he'll get top assistant head coach. He'll get the end of the roster. Like yeah. the, end of the, the end of the coach. Yeah, he'll get it next to both. That's saying a lot. <laughs> <laughs> Too much clout. That's saying a whole lot because of Vogel. 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 Okay. All right. So Chicago's going to play. They better. We just go ahead and get we that. Got, it was a whole problem. But they don't. Let me see. What Honestly, who else should go to the playoffs is the person they replaced Lonzo with. So Pelicans should be in the playoffs too. I agree. Uh, they got Devontae Graham. I mean, it's not Squirrel. <laughs> no. He's, the star, he's the starting point guard. They got Devontae Graham. Which, in my opinion, timeline wise works better for Zion and Bi almost in almost a lateral move. Yeah, I mean, kind of. I mean, because him and Lonzo are roughly uh, the same age. Yeah, I mean, not the same type of playmaker. But he yeah. averages eight assists, yeah. seven to eight assists a game. He better score. Yeah. So I mean, you got more more buckets. Yeah, I mean, he better shoot it. Better shoot it. Um, Jared Allen. Got his five year hundred million dollar contract that they've been talking about all season. Well, he was up, up for well, uh, Cleveland. Y'all got y'all a diamond in the Brooklyn. Y'all gonna regret that. Do y'all realize who y'all gave him? He actually could they, they could gel it together. Do you, do you realize? Am I wrong for saying this? I don't like Brooklyn, and everybody knows that one. But if they had kept Jared Allen somehow in the midst of all the trade, it would have been could they have beaten Milwaukee? Yes, Allen? yes. Jared Allen is he, missing piece? he averages he's right he's second in blocks behind Miles Turner. So he averages right at two so blocks. So is it true is it true to say that he was missing pieces working on the yeah, they, they, they probably don't want to change it up. Contain Yonis. Uh, contain Yonis. 
So you can't stop. You can contain him. He's seven foot and he gets you 12 to 15 rebounds a game. So he's worth probably $100 million. Absolutely. My man is basically I would, getting. Like, I would have been. Like, I would have twenty million a year. Right. It's only because Cleveland had one game hundred. Another team would get twenty. Cleveland four hundred million. Exactly. Cleveland without LeBron, they ain't got. Thanks. 